Hi everyone, I'm Mike, a South Florida firefighter, here again with Drone Nerds. And today, we're gonna do a field test of the CZI LP12 Broadcasting and Lighting System on the DJI M30T. Here's how the field test is gonna go. We're gonna demonstrate a search and rescue mission in the wooded area behind me. We're gonna put my partner in the wooded area we're gonna fly the M30T drone over, locate them with the thermal imaging pallets, and then let them know that help is coming with the broadcasting system. Let's see how it goes. All right guys, keep in mind, we're using a CZI demo unit with limited features available. So today we're gonna to demonstrate in the search and rescue mission, the text to speak option on this unit. Okay, we have the drone in the air and we're gonna do the search and rescue demonstration with the LP12 broadcasting system. So the first thing we're gonna to wanna to do is look over here on the right hand side of the screen and hit this PSDK icon. We have some options pop up. Now this is a demo unit, we don't have all the options available, but these are how to get quick access. To get better access, we click over here the right hand side and we have our PSDK and you can see at the top it says text to speech, which we're gonna demonstrate here in a minute. Then you have some more options. Uh, the tone, USA English, and we have uh, many options available to us. And then you have your volume. We're at 70% right now. We have a siren that we can use and hit play. And then we basically have a bunch of uh, gimbal options right here. So we're just gonna demonstrate today the text to speech. And we have hello, help is coming. So. Let's do the search and rescue. I'm going to hit my infrared camera on. Right now I have it on white hot color palette. Let's switch the color palette to iron red. This is daytime in South Florida. We have some overcast conditions with about a 15 mile an hour wind. So this is the wooded area where someone was reported missing. We're going to lower the drone and fly in here a little bit. And Let's pan this up and look, th there we go. We have him right there. I'm gonna click on white hot, which I really like for these conditions. And we'll fly in here just a little bit. We've located him. And then we're gonna get out of here and we are gonna hit, there you go. He heard us. So he's giving us a thumbs up and we're gonna let him know one more time. Okay, he, it looks like he can clearly hear us. So we're gonna back out here and that's it. That's demonstrating search and rescue, finding someone with the thermal and then letting them know the help's coming. So let's see here real quick, if we fly up, we are at almost 100 feet altitude. And here he is. There he is right there. Right here, we're in the iron red. Let's do black hot real quick. A little harder to see him. There we go. See him moving around right there. And we're going to go back and see if we can uh, have him here. Yeah, he heard us 100 feet high at 70% volume. So that's good to know. Okay, so that was a demonstration of the LP12 broadcasting system used with the thermal imaging camera, finding my friend in the woods back here. Keep in mind that we use the text to speech option. You do have the option to do a talk to speech, which is available on this broadcasting system. As you can see right here, the drone is about 150 feet behind me and we have it at 60 feet in the air. And if I go on my remote controller right here, I have, hello, help is coming. Now I'm at 70%. I'm gonna hit send. Hello, help is coming. I can clearly hear that. About 150 feet behind me at 60 feet in the air. So let's take the drone back another about 50 feet. I'd say it's about 200 feet behind me. Let's go up to 100 feet. Okay, I'm gonna go back and hit send again. I can still hear that pretty good. So it's not too noisy out here in the field, but 
Um, I think even if you have some noisy environments, you're still gonna be able to hear this good. Again, I'm at 70% volume. So if I raise this, um, you can clearly hear the speaker. Also keep in mind that we didn't even use the light. Today it's, it's light out. We were looking for someone in a lightly wooded area using the thermal, it worked good. But if you add the night to it, you have the thermal imaging camera with the light option. So I really like this payload for the M30T. Uh, it's already a feature heavy drone. I think this is huge for search and rescue. And I think it's a, it's a different, uh, I think it's definitely an asset for first responders, police and firefighters. This has been Mike with Drone Nerds featuring the LP12 lighting and broadcasting system on the DJI M30T. I loved how easy it was to access the interface of the broadcasting system and how easy it was to use. If you have any further questions or comments, feel free to leave them below or contact us at experts at dronenerds.com. Have a nice day.